A shot of a weapon ran out at approximately 4.30 on Friday evening along by a road in middle level at Tihagoda. It is reported that six teenagers were travelling in a three-wheeler collecting peacock feathers for the Katina Chivara Puja of the local temple. Among them was the student who sustained gunshot injuries. At the same time, three police officers from the Tihagoda police had visited the area to carry out a drug raid and inspected the three-wheeler in question. Three teenage boys fled the scene immediately, while 15-year-old Haresh Hansaka Deshanta, who was seated at the back, was shot. Two of the three police officers who had arrived in a police three-wheeler were dressed in civil attire. Haresh was the last to get off. When he was getting off, they shoved him. That was when the shot rang out. Haresh fell back inside. Then they put him in the police three-wheeler and took him and the rest to the Mathur hospital. The injured teenage boy was first admitted to the Mathra hospital and was then transferred to the Karapite teaching hospital for further treatment. My brother is in the ICU of the Karapite teaching hospital. Doctors are working on him. They did not comment about his situation. On Friday night, enraged locals visited the Tihagoda police and it led to a heated confrontation. Senior DIG in charge of the southern province, attorney Ajit Rohana, also visited the premises. We will not rule this as a normal accident. The SI has been interdicted with immediate effect. Legal action will be taken and a special police team will be conducting investigations. The Human Rights Commission of Sri Lanka launched its own investigation into the incident on Friday, dispatching officers from its Mathara office to the crime scene. One person had told to leave him behind and the driver had insisted to take him. The person who fired the shot was in civil attire. When the three-wheeler was ordered to stop, the boys had moved it to the side of the road. Thereafter, the shot was fired. Who shoots a 15-year-old boy? The 57-year-old police sub-inspector, whose weapon discharged, was produced to the Mathara magistrate Isru Nitikumara and was remanded to the 2nd of November 2022. <laughs>